can exert any real pressure on the Federer serve, the location of which against Steve Johnson in the opening round was spectacular. Game Federer. The one-two punch, pretty decent tonight already, out of the blocks here for Federer. Uh, which, for me, just creates more racket hit speed and more snap through the ball. Just too good that forehand Roger just yeah, lay into that ball up on his front side and then able to just play this behind him. I thought the forehand really set that point up though. Oh my goodness. For a long time, seeing the capabilities of doing these kind of things. Love how he stands up into the court, takes the ball early all the time, trying to emulate him, and they don't have the same skill set. Intentional that he pulled him in. Very, very good play. 15 14. Brilliant. Great feel on that ball. We saw again there the short return from Rodding with the with the chip return that he's not concerned about leaving it short in the court as long as it's down. I think I understand what you mean by that, Brad, but explain to the viewers at home as we see this challenge what you mean about why it's important to be down. As long as the ball stays down, which off of a chip backhand or even a chip forehand for certain guys, you can keep the ball low in the court and you force your opponent to have to come up to you with the next ball, which gives you a chance to then be able to be aggressive off that. Everyone talks about serve, but if you, if you can't put pressure on your opponent returning. It just makes it tough to to put any That's kind of cool. pressure at all throughout the match adequately to at least get through their their service games game Federer well he's used the forecourt a lot already Kranovic coming off his baseline it's good strong play of course Kranovic has been in three finals, That's one of which easy. was a Masters thousand where he came up short against Jackson. Could have hit this anywhere in the court. is so good. Great return. Great play to follow. <laughs> 117 last season. For, for me, that's a little bit below where you'd like to be as... Great finish. Lightning fast start from Roger Federer. I've seen that before. Five up. Uh, there's just not very many guys that basically half volley a ball off that, that gets deep in the court. And half volley it with a full swing. The opening set surely out of his reach already, but this is a nice little one-two of his own. He's able to really create some rotation and angle. I think it's an interesting conversation you can have as well. Great serve, set that ball up. Yeah, I believe that's a couple Federer. of minutes quicker than Novak managed to take the opening set today against Ito. Yeah, 
the ATP Cup as well. He's a he's a live wire out there. Karlovic did well there to keep his balance. Had he fallen into the net there, that ball hadn't bounced twice. He could have been in all sorts of trouble. Again, I think because he squares up, it's kind of a flat serve, isn't it? It doesn't cut. In yeah, the same he doesn't way. really slide that off the court from the from the wide position there. He was in all yeah. sorts of trouble off the return, wasn't he? If you were a Prianovic fan, you were holding your breath that Roger didn't unload, but he did. And down to another American, Tennis Sangren today. Guido Pella, as we see another half volley. Don't you know? If you weren't coaching Tommy Paul, what would you say? I mean, I'd say other than... Oh. I'd say it's a good shot to see Roger. How good was that? How long did he keep his eye? Game Federer. Mr. Koryunovic is challenging the ball on the service line. The ball scored here. Will be as fast as the night at 2.01. Doesn't always thrust the speedometer needle through the 200s. But when he does, he still makes the line. Just softening him up for the next one. Game. That's Brilliant. worked nicely. He's found a, a little bit of a rhythm to the servant volley, but not often enough. Nicely done off the uh, Pitino. Backhand. Just couldn't do quite as much as he much heavier spin through the ball off the backhand side once he started playing with this racket. A racket or a wand, which one is it? It's a little no, bit of both deep. with Roger. It's a little bit of both. It's definitely a hybrid, isn't it? shape the ball a little bit differently, just to do different things and feel the ball in a different way. Wow. Petch, I was just about to say that that was a well-played volley from Prajanovic. It was. And it was. But you had the wizard with his wand on the other side, and that is a spectacular pass from that position. As we see, Kranovic could do nothing but watch it go by. Not again. Nobody can repeat that sort of excellence twice. Juice. Try and stay as tight to Federer's. as possible and he's done that in that game that courier guy must have been a nightmare juice wrong shot Brad you could light it up for some periods of time during uh, sets, Patch. When I had access to the switch. Oh, there's that close stance you talk about. How does he, he gets around this ball and then creates a closed stance position to be able to attack that ball. From where he hit the first forehand to where he hit the last forehand.
Well, when you see the drop shot from Roger, you always want to give a little tribute That's to his great rival, Rafael Nadal. Game. Brainovich. Through that list and made improvements in. Roger actually took himself so far Love out of the team. play there with the four. Krajanovic, good job just steering that down the line to win the point. That's pretty. Serving one. Doesn't spend a whole lot of time on the practice Jeez. for hitting buckets to serve these. Yeah. He's done it. Yeah. Really impressive from Granovic. Mr. Krajanovic is challenging the call on the right near side line. The ball's going in. Do you think it's out, Brad? Huh? From uh, my vantage point here, I thought it looked like it might be out. But the wand has Love the team. worked its magic again. Taking a little lesson out of Novak's book. Game Federer. Roger himself, who was pretty fiery as we see him, uh, walks to a 30 love lead in this crucial game. Federer okay, side of the scoreboard, sense. very much going Federer. the right way. It is two sets to love. It got a little tricky Plus towards the end, to but he comes through it all the same. Again, in that position, kind of forcing Kranovich to come forward. Danger time here. Game Fedora. 20 to 30 minutes at the most. Beautiful lob from Franovic. Phenomenal volley from the position. Yeah, he carved that ball. It just stayed so low. Well done by Kranovich. Mr. Federer is challenging the call. Left center service line. The ball scored in. Juice. rotation through that with the hips.
is relative to each player. Roger doesn't need as much time as other players do to be able to, to change direction on a ball like that. Done by Kranovich there. Zero. Zero. Well done for the next day, so <laughs> don't use that as an excuse because I hear that one as well. Game for the run. So that James Kyothorn could go back and listen to the audio on it. Great shot. Game, Federer. Federer just marshalling that one out. He's get what he's going to do. Yeah, you see him take a glimpse. The eyes, the eyes are definitely still 14. focused down at the other end of the court. Finishes as he started. Six one. Sublime six performance one. from six Roger Federer. Another magical run here, potentially underway at the Australian Open. Straight sets in his first two matches.